All right, so we're done with that. Uh, one of the things I wanted to uh, note is that um, of course you want to go to the uh, Arch Wiki. I'm just going to do it here. I'm going to go Mac Book. Again, you want to once you get here, by the way, the uh, the KDE version on a uh, iMac is pretty solid. Got to check it out. Um, when you're done with the partitioning, and you go to installation, that's where we're going next. Um, pretty simple. Going to there's a couple little notes here. Look at the uh, for BIOS booting, this section right here. That's what we're going to do now. Again, this is still on the uh, MacBook Air. Okay, let's jump in here. Sorry for the uh, hokey setup here. It's a little bit tough getting the screen going. Configure system. rc.conf. I do a couple notes here. I call mine. I can figure out how to type. Arch. MBA. Interface. Uh, because we have the dongle, we can use Ethernet. ETH0 if it's wireless, if, you want, if you're brave and you want to try to do the wireless, you do WLAN0 here for interface. I tried it for a while, gave up because it's uh, it just doesn't like to work very well. Supposedly the, uh, the arch boot helps you with that, but I even had fa uh, failures with that as well. So it's easier to get a dongle, trust me. Save that, and that's obviously Control X, and then Y for saving, hit enter to, enter to exit out of there. Pac-Man. Dot D, a couple notes here, a couple little uh, little goodies that uh, I can show you. Uh, capital I, capital O, lowercase v, e, capital C, lowercase a, and d, y. Gives you a cool little animation for Pac-Man. I go down to the multi-lib, only makes sense because you're going to be downloading some 32-bit drivers. Uncomment out the multi-lib. And then one last note. You want to type this in, just, just type it exactly. Open bracket, arch, Linux, fr, close bracket, enter, capital S, server, space equals space, http, forward forward, repo, dot arch, Linux, dot fr, forward slash, dollar sign, arch. You see that okay? Looks like it. That's so you can install Yart, Yart, Yart. <laughs> I don't know if I've heard anybody say that right. Yart, and you can get to the Arch user repository there. And I'll show you how to do that in a few, in a few steps. Control X, Y, enter. Uh, Pac-Man, obviously, just like every other install. I leave Canada uncommented. And if you can hold down function and control and down page, it's like a page down. Or just a down arrow, it's like a page down. And I always start after cake because for some reason cake never works. And this is just over, down, backspace quickly if you do it a few times. Root password. done. Okay, the next step is the tricky one, so uh, uh, screw it, I'll just wait. Okay, install bootloader. Now we're going to, this is a key so that you can reboot correctly. You go to, let's go from the top so you can see it. You're going to go down until you get to the kernel here. The kernel. 
and you're going to go over to the RO. You're going to say space piece at reboot equals PCI, and I'm going to do it to the to the fallback as well. Reboot equals PCI. Supposedly that's so that it can uh, correctly reboot. I'm going to do one more thing because the NVIDIA driver plays havoc with uh, gives you these really ugly uh, distorted screen. I'm going to go ahead and put it in no mode set. By the way when I first, uh, if you have trouble doing this and the screen's all screwed up from the beginning, when you're in the initial login uh, to, to say start Arch Linux the, on the CD disk to first launch it, hit tab and do the same thing. Uh, hit tab on the when you first have the uh, the arch logo up here and you have the kernel here. Hit tab, and it uh, page over to the uh, to the end, and also do the no mode set, and it'll give you this this uh, view here as opposed to the smaller text, but it's just distorted as hell. Control X Y Enter. Go down to SDA. They say don't do this, but I've had fine success doing this, so I'm going to go ahead and. Uh, Install it to SDA, works fine. So I'm going to exit install. It uh, seems to happen every time now. Now I'm going to reboot, and I have I have OS X on a flash here. I'm going to reboot. Just type in reboot. Enter. Hold down the Option key. Okay, so go to Mac OS X, and I'm going to give it a minute to boot up. All right, so OS X booted up. You can see the mouse here. You go up to Utilities Terminal. Should be really comfortable with the terminal now. Shouldn't be daunting. Give yourself lots of space because it's really small text on the screen and you're going to be spitting out a whole bunch of numbers. Now do disk util space list and this is in the uh, the same deal here where we installation phase uh, for uh, BIOS compatibility the additional steps after Linux only install, sorry I was looking at the screen additional steps after Linux only install, sorry it's a little shaky one hand you're going to disk util list and for BIOS compatibility you do this command right here. So I'm going to get a close up as much as I can. So hit disk util list spits out a whole bunch of stuff. And what we're interested in and scroll up to the top here is your disk one disk 0s you have your boot partition here made bootable file system Linux your identifier is disk 0s1 okay so now we go to the bottom on the wrong screen the very bottom I'm put the screen down here so you can actually see it we're going to type in bless that's really hard to type hands in the way uh, dash dash oops I'm messing up my ok so we have to move it back a little bit bless dash dash uh, device and don't worry, I'll uh, get out of the way once I get it typed in. Dev disk 0s1 space dash dash set capital B OT dash dash legacy dash dash verbose. It is 
is right there. Bless device dev. Hit enter. Now it gives you a bunch of stuff here, and at the very bottom, I was worried about this because it said boot args not set. But when I let's see if I can do reboot from here. Never tried it. Yeah, it does. Cool. I'm gonna unplug everything. So now everything's unplugged. It should come up. Ah, oh, it's a beautiful thing. There you go. Now you have Arch Linux on your MacBook Air. I'm gonna. We can do this now. I'm gonna break this up so I can edit it later.